y'all seen it in the title this is a realistic morning routine and this is me realistically in the morning this is honestly how i woke up this morning this is going to be a realistic morning routine slash spend the day with me you might ask why did i decide to do this video or why did i decide to come in front of the world without my teeth y'all know i'm all about inspiring motivating and helping people i received a comment yesterday that really made my day it was really touching i'll put it right here so basically she was saying that my videos my denture videos really helped her a lot it motivated her to save up her money and get hers i don't think she got her permanence yet she went and got the procedure and now she got her temporaries in and she said she's really happy and she has no regrets i don't know i was just happy to be a part of that i will make a denture playlist i'll leave it right here if anybody interested in watching you know just to help inspire motivate you if you need dentures or you need you know dental work and, and it just wasn't her comment that inspired me to do this type of video I receive a lot a lot of emails a lot of DMs of women my age around my age some be a little bit younger some be a little bit older needing dentures and it was really surprising to me in the beginning because when you think of dentures, you always think of old people, right? So when I first started my denture journey, I would watch a lot of YouTube videos. And now there weren't many YouTube videos out there. People would got dentures, implants, and everything. These are what my implants look like. For the top, for the bottom. And I definitely couldn't find no videos of people of color that got them, that went through this journey. Me as a vlogger, I try to be as transparent with y'all as much as possible without putting all of my business out there, but I try to be transparent. So it was only right for me to vlog my journey. I did ask my dentist like the day of consultation or was it a day of surgery? I can't remember, but I asked him, I said, do you get a lot of younger people like around my age that, you know, get dentures? He was like, yeah. He was like, a lot. He was like, you will be surprised. And the assistant, she was in the room. Shout out to Danielle. She was in the room and she was like, yeah, we just had a 24 year old in here the other day. That kind of made me feel better. But I'm humbled that I can be an inspiration, a motivation for too many of you out there, whether it be my denture journey or whatever. All right, so enough of me talking, let's get started. Okay, so I do keep my dentures in this denture container. I soak them in here overnight. I don't want to spill it, but yeah, they in there so I just pour the water off I use two different cleaning tablets polydent three minute daily cleanser and I also use this one it's the retainer bright so before I pop my dentures in I have to clean my implant so I just take this soft toothbrush that I got off of Amazon I just brush them in like a so circular motion then I'll go in with some mouthwash I love this mouthwash pour it in the cup just like you do and after I spit that out I go back in again with another not a cap full but probably half a cap and goggle <sighs> these are what my dentures look like these are the bottom, that's what they look like. And these are the top. So I'm gonna go in and clean them. So I just take this denture toothbrush. I also use this Dr. Bronner's peppermint scented soap. And then I just take the soap, cause I need my dentures clean, honey. I need them clean. So, and then I just take the brush and brush them. so fresh and so clean and clean I just pop them in and y'all just line it up there the bottom okay 
right now that we got those in it's time to get my face together and you may be wondering am i satisfied with my teeth yes and no i don't regret anything the procedure and everything went smoothly the healing process went smoothly like i said if you want to see more in depth of the procedure and the journey in general make sure you check out my previous videos the teeth are beautiful i mean i can't complain i know y'all seen what my teeth look like before so i can't complain about what these look like i got to pick out the shade i got the shade that's right before the brightest white i forget i think it was a2 don't quote me like i said you have to look at the past videos because i did vlog that i don't know it's just the way that it makes my jaw look I don't know if they need to be bigger. You know, I don't know. I ain't about to sit here and complain because <laughs> what my teeth look like before, <laughs> I ain't got no room. So yeah, I'm about to get this face together and my hair together. Y'all see me just put that bonnet off, right? I literally can walk out the door like this. I'll straighten this up a little bit, fluff it out a little bit. But I do like to spray this um, lavender water and glycerin. I love it for my hair and for my face. I use the La Roche. Pochet. A hydrating gentle cleanser for normal to dry skin. Love it. And I'm also going to be using my turmeric scrub, which I have pre-orders going on right now. You can pre-order your turmeric scrub, any of my other products on my website right now. I do have a coupon code for you guys for 20% off your total order. I love using this turmeric scrub on my face because it gets all of that dead skin off and it will have your skin glowing if you have like acne scars hyperpigmentation or anything like that i will let this sit for about five to ten minutes i usually don't let mine sit i only need to use this maybe once or twice a week everybody's skin is different you know your skin just like you know your body if you feel your face has that dullness and it needs that glow whip out the turmeric scrub then i'm gonna just go in and spray the lavender water since I'm going out today and I'm gonna be in that sun, I use my Oil Olay Regenerous and it has SPF 25 in it. If I'm not going anywhere, I won't use that. I'll just use my Rose Glow Oil. Since I'm trying to protect my skin as long as possible because this Florida sun be out here banging. Now I don't need my Rose Glow Oil, which is on the website, you can pre-order it. I just love the way it makes my face glow it just gives a different kind of glow and by putting the oil on top it's sealing in the moisture so it would keep your face moisturized and glowy all day all right so that's that i'm gonna do something to these eyebrows in a minute but i'm about to hop in the shower enough i just need to pop some earrings on but the mascara i'm using is this better than sex by Too Faced. this was their limited edition mascara that i purchased from sephora or alta like over a year ago so i don't use mascara that much especially when i have on my glasses the eyebrow pencil i'm using is this l'oreal it ain't gonna focus it ain't gonna let me be great and focus for y'all but yeah it's a l'oreal uh brow stylist definer got it at target and it's in soft black if y'all don't know i'm intermittent fasting so i'm not gonna eat until 12 it is almost 11 right now what i'm about to do is finish up these poshmark orders i ran out of tape and i had my husband pick up some while he was out so i have to tape those up i bought a new comforter for my bed right there it's my old comforter right there so i gotta throw that in the washer let me show y'all what I got from Coach the other day. What a package came the other day. I'm always shopping on a Coach outlet, so I picked up this sunglasses case. It's too cute, right? So I picked that up, and I also picked up this Coach umbrella. Then this is what I got on today, something simple, because all I'm probably gonna do today is run errands. Oh, y'all see my she and stuff over here? I might as well show y'all, right? Right, right? Also got some jewelry as well. So, oh, let me pop in my nose rings. I forgot. Yes. 
I picked up about seven of these nose rings. Some of them got like bent in the packaging, so I'm gonna have to bend them back. So yeah, I picked up seven of those. They were only a dollar. This is a bracelet set. These are anklets. I love the chunky anklets. These are some cute earrings I thought would go with the bathing suits that I've been picking up at Shein. And then this is a necklace, I guess. Picked up one bathing suit, and this is what the bottoms look like. <laughs> Don't know who I'm feeling like. I don't know this is what the top looks like and I will do like a Shein haul on these items and the items from last week not a haul, try on haul got the little peekaboo hole Ciao. and then you can tie this around your neck interesting even though if I don't wear the bottoms or the top I can always wear this i can put on a black one piece and then i can use this cover up because i think it's so pretty the colors are pretty i love the design wrap it around your waist tie it up and then you have this cute cover up then i purchased this cute top love the colors and the design i love the ruffles i love the neck part i thought it was cute then i just picked up some like silky pajamas I'm pretty sure this is not real silk, probably like polyester or something, but it feels nice. And it comes with these shorts. Then I got this cute shirt, trying to step out of my comfort zone just a little bit. I ain't going too far, but just this little cute flowy halter top. You got this little ring right here where you put this in, and then I guess you tie it around your neck to keep it in place, off the shoulder, yeah grab this Los Angeles shirt I have it in brown and I love the way it fit on me so I thought I'd grab the black then I just got this California shirt which I don't know how I feel about this it looks so wide and short it looks like the lettering need to be bigger or something it's definitely short it's wide I might be wearing this as pajamas all right so let's finish up these Poshmark orders so I can get them out and I want to see how this little comforter look on my bed I got it off of Amazon and it's just this nice pretty green color on yet because I'm washing my pillowcases but so far it's a vibe it just adds to the room I love it it's an oversized king because Cleveland is always on me about snatching the covers as you can see it hangs over a lot finally about to send this vanity back what that say <laughs> That's one of many reasons to use duct tape that's cute <laughs> Oh, you found it at the thrift store? Yeah, like a long time ago. Mm -hmm. I just cut it. It was way too. It was like down here. Mm -hmm. and you waiting on Deja to get out of school? Oh. I'm about to um, wash them probably tomorrow and try to retwist. Really? <laughs> yeah. You go you vlog it? Probably. You film it? She got a lot of them. I don't got as nearly as many yeah. as hers. Probably wash them tomorrow. They soft? Yeah. <laughs>
was just about yeah, to tell them. I knew that, bro. Before I talked on the camera, look, we had Starbucks. And before I turned on the camera, Cleveland was like, Don't say I told right. you to come here. Right, or I made you. <laughs> oh, maybe. Because him. And and I'm like, that. Let me get the camera. Because I showed them was about to say it. Yeah. It is. Because otherwise, I'm we would not a, be I'm, here. I'm just getting a small black coffee. What, what you doing? I, like, you ain't got to get out the car or nothing. I know, but it's like, ten, and, uh, look, I haven't had Starbucks in like two months. So I'm just about to get a small mango dragon fruit right. lemonade no 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 lemonade i'm not even and gonna add i'm not even gonna put more uh added sugar then that's gonna turn into every day and it's gonna get bigger no bigger. i got self-control now it's gonna like it's i gonna got a little bit more self-control no, i don't, I don't. <laughs> well, I, i'm saying with them gummy bears once i start eating them joints i'm eating them every day until i'm tired of them <laughs> <laughs> Those Black Forest organic gummy bears. I'm yeah, like, y'all. He, like he go to BJ's and buy a huge box. Nah, like how many in there? 120? Nah. No, it's only 80. And the bag's stupid little. Only 80? Well, but but the bag's stupid little. It's like eight gummy bears in there. So you, it just look ridiculous because you see a whole bunch of packs everywhere. Because I I'm trying to get at least 20 bears and you gotta open three, four packs to get it. So it's like yeah. them little packs for little kids. So, I mean, it's 80 mm -hmm. of them. Yeah. Anyway, let's go in here and get some Starbucks. Oh, it's going to taste so good. I ain't had it in two months. And y'all know I used to drink Starbucks during their every day. Shout out to Layla again. She sent me this $15 gift card. Okay. Hi, can I get a small mango dragon fruit? No lemonade. And light ice. A small mango dragon fruit with light ice, no lemonade. Okay. Yeah. Love y'all. Yeah. Hey. Flat. You guys are also be coming right out. Oh, I'm trying to look for my coffee though. Hey, ladies, what you doing here with the snacks? We're in here. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. They had to specially make his stuff because he said they said they stopped serving. Dark? No, blonde. After, oh, blonde after uh, 12. So that's what took so long with his stuff. I didn't want, but he didn't even tell me. He just let me order it instead of saying, oh, we're out of blonde roast, and then he had to do all that extra stuff. Yeah. But that dark roast make my stomach hurt. So good. Got a small. So we about to go pick up my food from Vita 365. Y'all see? What? I'll tilt it. Yeah. No, I'll tilt it. You got that huge straw. Yeah, I gotta have a straw with my drinks because I don't know. It's it's just a vibe for me. Like it, it don't taste the like it don't taste the same if I don't have a straw. I know I'm not the only one out here like that. Like I cannot drink out of that little bitty old hole. The fruit be all up at the top and blocking the blocking hole. the hole. But anyway, I'm about to go get my food. I order what I always order. A turkey burger and uh, potato wedges. And I ordered a smoothie, a strawberry banana mango smoothie. That's a lot of sugar intake for the day. Let's see if I spill this one more time. It's 140, and this will be my first meal of the day. And I'm not even hungry. See, my stomach is um is trained, I guess. I can tell it definitely got smaller because I be getting full fast. Turkey burger, these like grilled onions. Lettuce, tomatoes, this guacamole down in there, some potato wedges, and I got a strawberry banana mango smoothie. Um, I'm probably, that was good. I'm probably gonna give Naya my smoothie. We about to go pick her up from school anyway. But yeah, I can't, I can't drink that and drink my Starbucks. So I'm just gonna drink my Starbucks. That ain't even that good anyway. So if I'm gonna be getting some unnecessary sugars, it's gonna be good. Cleveland just went into 7-Eleven to get me some Uts chips. Y'all, I love the Utch chips. The hot ones, mm. Did they have them? Yeah. The hot ones? Yeah, they did. Uh, yeah. But I said, how often y'all get these honey barbecue in? Mm -hmm. It's like, oh, the truck comes like every two days. So I'm like, cool. Because if you got them, mm -hmm. I'm coming to get them. Right. That one at least. Yeah, Cleveland um, can never find honey barbecue ones. He had never tasted the honey barbecue ones here. It wasn't yeah. until when we was in Gallenberg, yeah. he got some from Publix and he been liking them ever since, but could never find them. Cause before what flavor was you getting? Uh, the, um, that, that. It was something barbecue. 
Oh, it's called Sweet Heat. Yeah, Sweet Heat. I don't like that one. It's yeah. too much. This one is real subtle. All right, I'm home. Don't know what I'm about to get into, but I need to do some type of workout because your girl ain't do nothing yesterday. I don't know. I'm going through mail. World of Hyatt. What they talking about? Escape to Florida brochure. I'm already here. I think the rest of this is garbage. Oh, this is my check from the city. Y'all remember I told y'all I signed Naya up for swim lessons, right? Why they come calling me? This was like last month sometime. Talking about they had to cancel it because they didn't have enough instructors. She's like, we're gonna refund you and, but it's gonna be in form of a paper check. Like a refund for the swim lessons an amount of a hundred dollars. So I got a hundred dollar check, hey, it's like that. I'm about to deposit this in my bank account. I'm just open my app up on my phone, take a picture of it and boom. Like I'm always getting these pre-approved. Trying to get me to get credit cards. Look, here go another one. Here go another one and they be trying to add a little fake card in there. Garbage. Oh, make sure I got my check to the side. I don't want to throw that away. Oh, it look like I got a DH gate. Some, maybe a, some jewelry I ordered. Oh, this the little um, nose ring I ordered off of Etsy. That's what it looked like. That's cute. Let's see what it looked like. Let me take this one out. This one's cute and all, but all of them was bent up. So it kind of lays funny in my nose or on my nose and I'm not going to be able to perfectly shape it. So that kind of sucks. I said they were only a dollar, but still see how this one fits and looks. I said I was going to go ahead and get make an appointment for a real one because when I was live the other day, y'all was hyping me up. So oh, this one's cute. Yeah, that one's cute. Let me throw this in the garbage. Oh, I received my bottles for the rose glow oil and the um, hair growth oil. So here's to the droppers, the bottles, like that. This is the eight ounce for the hair growth oil. And I know I told y'all, and it also states on the website that your order probably won't ship until June 14th, but probably will ship sooner because it looks like I'm getting or going to get all of my supplies and stuff in sooner than I thought. That's the first. All right, I'm at the end of the vlog here. Oh, first, let me show y'all what I picked up at Kohl's. So I got this Sprite t-shirt and then y'all seen I got the Bretts for Naya. The shirts were two for 20, so that's why I grabbed this one. And I bought this candle. This brand is one of the best candles ever. And this one's going right in my room. I got one in the front and then I got one in the living room. This one is Blue Java Banana, Seaside Mimosa, Tamarind, and Stone Fruit. It smells so good. It, it smells tropical. I'm just probably going to leave it here. I'm about to light it. This is what the wick looks like and it crackles. It creates a long, beautiful flame. It fills your room with fragrance. That it does. This candle would definitely have your whole house smelling good and then it says the comforting crackle of a fireplace my fan is kind of messing it up i gotta finish straightening up my room edit this video jump in the shower and i'm about to chill didn't do any kind of exercise today this will be the second day in a row that's a problem so tomorrow i'm definitely hitting the trail if i feel like it after i finish editing and cleaning up this room i might turn on the adventure game or the apple fitness but i know for sure i'm getting up in the morning and hitting the trail all right i hope y'all enjoyed this video and if you're watching this and you're not subscribed sus subscribe i really appreciate y'all supporting me in whatever i do y'all always come through buying my products y'all be eating my poshmark closet up and of course supporting me here on youtube i really do appreciate y'all and i just want to thank y'all for loving me for me but yeah anyway i just want to thank y'all for accepting me for me i will pick y'all up tomorrow and i promise i will charge my gopro and take y'all along on the trail because some of y'all told me that the bike riding footage is comforting or soothing for y'all you know it may not be for you but it is for someone else yeah i try to make everybody happy can't make all y'all happy but 
If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you made it to the end, drop a comment down below telling me you made it to the end. I need to know where my loyal fam at. I am going to be making like a members only, I forget what you call it, but YouTube has been notifying me that this feature is available for like a year now. So I signed up for it yesterday and I got approved for it this morning. It's basically like you become a member of mine. I think you pay like $2.99 or $4.99 a month. All right, I'm gonna let y'all go. I'll call y'all back tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>